Hi, my name is Marlon Oz. I'm a systems engineer with NetApp. Today I'm going to uh, give you a demo of ODX. And what is ODX? This is um, Windows Offload Data Transfer, which is uh, included with uh, Windows Server 2012 and Windows 8. So basically, uh, it gives you abil the ability to, to directly transfer data uh, within or between compatible storage devices and cluster data on tap um, is one of those devices. So you basically get to bypass the host computer, which is really important, uh, especially when, when you're doing uh, large uh, data transfers. Um, think about it. So traditionally, when a host needs to do a copy operation, the host first reads the data from the source location in a storage device to, to the host buffer, then writes the data in the buffer to the destination in the same or different storage device. So um, Basically, the host is in the midst of the copy operation. The data has to go through the host during the copy operation. So ODX shortens the data path of the copy operation. Uh, so basically, you don't have to go through the host. They have a way of exchanging tokens so that the storage array basically does all the work. Um, and I'm going to demonstrate that here for you. Um, I have an iSCSI LUN mapped to a Windows uh, 2012 server. You can see this LUN here, it's mapped. Uh, uh, this is the actual LUN, <clears throat> 20 gig LUN. Um, here is uh, the actual LUN. And I have a folder uh, that's about um, you know, 2.4 gigs. First, I'm going to show you um, I'm going to copy it locally from um, the C drive to the desktop. And you're going to see the transfer rates. You know, now it says it's going to take about 50 minutes. Um, you know, this isn't usually that accurate, but you can see the transfer speeds here. Now, this isn't a virtual environment. Uh, but still, you can see how slow it's going. Now it says about three minutes, but still, we'll let this go for a little bit. I'm not going to let it go the whole time. Uh, we'll let it go up to about 20% uh, complete. Now I'm going to cancel it. Just want to give you the idea of the difference of the copy rates with ODX pretty significant. Okay, there's about 21%, uh, 22%. <clears throat> now let's stop this. And now let's copy this file within the NetApp LUN. So this is on the storage system now. Um, it's the same file. Actually, let's delete this first and you'll even see how fast the delete um, occurs. It's done. Now let's copy that file and see how uh, much quicker it occurs with ODX. You can see it says about one minute. Remember this is in a virtual environment. Um, but you can see the speed uh, is almost triple uh, what we were seeing before. And we'll let this run through. So, I mean, we're already at 30% before. We were probably only at 5%. And you can see it's jumping around. Speed would be more consistent if this wasn't in a VM, but you can still see the difference. It's unbelievable. Um, there we go. It's, it's done. I mean, and that was probably about the same time where it got about 20%.
So and that's a two and a half uh, gig file. So that's just an example of you know ODX and how Cluster Dead on Tap um, has this built into the system. You don't have to do anything. It's enabled automatically, and uh, this works with uh, uh, Windows Server 2012 and Windows 8.